Hey guys, Buff59 here, coming to you with another video review. This time we're looking at the SH Figuarts Iron Man 2 Iron Man action figure. And this is thanks to my buddy Brian, who lent me his figure to review. This is a very cool figure, I've never owned these. This is by Bandai. It's out right here, it has a little band and then a die. Tamashi Nations. That's the sub company that it works for. Very cool Japanese ratings here. Pause and read that if you're Asian. And then over here we have Pokewall and some other warning labels. Marvel. Very cool box. I like the the little signaling thing of it. The picture of Iron Man right there. Nothing on the sides. <clears throat> on the back here we have the other two. You got the War Machine and Mark VI Iron Man. Simple style and heroic action. Gimmicks and effect parts. And it's in Japanese also if you want to read that. Here's all the extra parts it comes with. So yeah, very cool. Let's get this guy open and see how cool okay, so it is. Here we have SH Figuarts Iron Man open up and out of the packaging. As you can tell, he comes with the blaster. I put the blaster on him already. Of course, you can take it out. There's the different accessories that it comes with. Different hands right there. And different blasters of all size, shape and size. And the cool part about it is that you can remove this part over here of the hand. Very nice. <clears throat> and you can take the hand out like so. Pop in the other hand. Like so. And then just plug this part back in. It has a little thing right there. Put it on the top. Shoot, come on. There you go. Put it back on. You can see? And it's articulated right there. You can lift that up. So when you do articulate the hand, it's no problem because this thing can lift up and go back down. Now this guy has articulation of the wazoo. As you can tell, his head goes around 360 can look up very nicely so it can do very good flying poses the chest is also very articulated it can go down all the way like this the chest unfortunately does not light up but it's got some very nice detail on there you can see the inside of the arc reactor very nice there's some shimmering color right there it's all nice and metallic red with some sparkly stuff on there very cool chest can go upward downward that much. And he's got a triple thread articulation right here. You can move this also. And it works well with the ab <clears throat> with the ab crunch. Wow this thing keeps on focusing. It works very well with the ab articulation. Legs can go forward and back and in and out. So it's on a T joint. Legs have two point of articulation. You can tell. It's very nice and detailed. Can't get over how much detail this thing has. Over here you can tell also the foot is nicely articulated. And I believe the toes, yeah the toes are articulated as well. Uh, not much angle pivot for this guy. And the arms can go forward and back, in and out, and he has a little extended joint inside of the arm. If you want to make it go outward more or put it back inward more. And of course the shoulder pads right here allow for various ranges of articulation as it doesn't hinder the articulation at all. Two points right here in the elbow. Even on the shoulder pads here it's very articulate so you can move that around as you bend the elbow and whatnot. And the, heart, the hand of course goes around 360 and articulation right here in this palm. Very nice figure. Over here in the back, you can see a lot more detail. It's very detailed. Nothing was amiss on this figure. The part here on the back, you can lift this up. If I can get it in there. As you can see, you can take that out. It's very detailed inside here too. And then you just... This is what, right? 
Here's the left piece. And just plug that right there. And make it like like it's open while he's doing the flying pose. It's very nice. Very cool that they give you all these accessories for the figure. Because a lot of people like to pose their figures in various ways. The shoulder pieces also come off as well. You just gotta take the front piece out first. And then you take the back piece out. Like so. And then you can see it's highly detailed right there in the back as well. You got all the rivets and turbines and torques and whatnot. And then you can just put this piece in here where it'll fit. And then put the front piece back on its on the figure right there where does it go here we go put that back in there and it'll hold that in place so if you got him in flying pose you can obviously lift up the flaps on the back make it look like he's flying and whatnot it's a very cool figure and nice accessories as well so much articulation on this Again, it's very fragile though because there's a lot of pieces on here. And you don't want to <clears throat> don't want to lose any of these because they're very essential for the figure. As you can tell. So yeah, you just pop the other parts back on there, and it looks good as new. It doesn't even look like he has any uh, there's any gaps or anything in the parts where there's open articulation. So yeah, it's a very cool figure. And I highly recommend it if you're a big Iron Man fan. As my buddy Brian here is. You can look at more details here on the face. You can tell it's very nicely detailed. <sighs> Come on, zoom. There you go. Got very nice detail on there in the face. You can see all the little screws on there. The face is not removable, by the way. It's like that. Tons of detail on this figure. I'm telling you. I hear they're making a <clears throat> SH Fig Wars of the Avengers. So that should be cool. So yeah, what do you think of this review, guys? And this figure itself, isn't it cool? I think it's nice. Very neat. Um, they don't come with a stand, unfortunately, but it stands pretty well on its own. And for a good 60 bucks, you can own this figure online. If you check out some online stores <clears throat> or also eBay, get them for a good price. They're very nice, uh, very nice figures. Highly recommend. So don't forget to like this video, guys, if you enjoyed it. It was helpful for you. And subscribe for more videos coming soon. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching.